call me wide-eyed, simple-minded I've been blinded, I'm on a merry-go-round I got this fever, baby, going through my body I feel like shaking the ground What's up everyone welcome back to my channel or if you're new hi i'm Haley, and i'm so happy you're stopping by today's video i hope you'll stick around and subscribe on my channel i love sharing tons of kidney motivation mom motivation and all things homemaking and decorating videos and in today's video we are going to be doing a weekly reset clean with me typically i like to do these on mondays or fridays just getting my house either ready for the week resetting it or just ready for the weekend it kind of just depends on what we have going on and what we're doing so this particular day it was a friday i know we weren't going to have too much going on for the weekend so i just wanted to reset my house so that way as we went throughout the weekend we could just slowly tidy up the house and it wasn't getting too crazy but sometimes our weekends can be really nuts and we're going in and out so much that it's really nice to just have my Monday reset where I just get the house nice and reset. So the first thing that I'm doing in today's video is just tidying up the living room. We really had done like a pillow fort. She had like a whole bunch of baby things out, Legos, so many toys. So I wanted to go ahead and start out with this area first. Now that I got the living room clean, I'm going to go ahead and vacuum up this rug and then we will move on into clearing off my table a little bit and then once we get that finished, we'll move on into the bathroom to give it a really good deep clean. kitchen table wasn't too messy so I was just picking up the few things putting them away and then I was going to move on into the bathroom and I did want to give the bathroom a thorough deep clean so I'm going to clean off all of the counters I'm going to wipe them down clean the mirrors clean the sink clean the toilet the toilet the floors all of it I just wanted to give it a super good thorough clean how often do you guys clean your bathroom i shoot for every single week sometimes that doesn't happen and if it doesn't i usually skip out on cleaning the tub but i usually really try to stick on a good schedule of cleaning weekly just because i don't want to get behind on it and have it get too gross i feel like it's easy to manage that way so you'll have to let me know how often you clean your bathrooms this has been kind of fun Look, there's a booze right here One or a few on there Man, did you see me though? Cause the short put on the show I'm dancing on the tables and I must say
usually the one who acts out All those crazy little things we all kinda dream about A good thing we are running out of sunlight It's not necessary for these guys to know all about Look, there's a bruise right here One or a few on there Short foot on the show I'm dancing on the tables And I must say I got a taste for a flip and out I'm glancing at the haters And I know they wish they did the shit I did tonight You wanna break some things, alright All of the cups are out of sight You wanna drink, cause I can buy You're dancing on the table, so am I Did you see? A short foot on a show I've been looking into getting one of those electric scrubbers or even just like a extended scrubber. The one thing I absolutely hate about cleaning a tub is like bending over and cleaning everything. So I'm thinking about getting one. Would you? spend the extra money and get the electric one or would you get just like the old-fashioned like extended scrubber just so I don't have to like be bending down as much you'll have to let me know what you prefer I'm kind of leaning towards the extended like electric one that has like the different pieces so I can use it around my house but I just don't know for sure how much I use will use it and if it's worth the extra money so you'll have to let me know what you if you use it if you enjoy it or if i should just get like a regular one i told myself that maybe he ain't worth it too bad i hate advice cause out of sight and out of mind
out the bathroom all clean, I wanted to head into Waverly's room, kind of just quickly tidy things up. And then something else I like to do on a like weekly basis is just kind of clean her area and clean her sheets. I will say lately, I've been having to clean her sheets more just with how potty training things are going. Um, there's some things that she's really good with and then other things not so much i'm not going to get in too much detail but um we've just been having to change the sheets more so i always like to do i basically always am doing laundry but i really like to do like one load a day of laundry and it usually makes it so then like the weekends i usually don't have to do too many and then there's a couple days a week i do like two so it's usually not too bad but this day i wanted to wash her clothes and i wanted to throw in some sheets and I, I think i had already started laundry actually on this day so i went ahead and fold the laundry that was in there put the laundry that was in the washer into the dryer and then went ahead and um started a new load as well so that's what i'm going to go ahead and do now hello how'd you do i'm not broken i'm just split in two hope you're fine Ain't got time to do everything you said you would Frames of the past and the memory of you just come running by Pictures of sunny days with your smile in the bar How could they say I was broken? How could they say you made me come undone? Now I know that it's okay Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them oh. How could they say I was broken? How could they say you made me come undone? Now I know that it's okay Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them To be cool, even wear that shirt you wanted to. My friends think I'm lame. Since I met you, I am not the same. It was not meant to be a fairy tale with a happy end. Girl, you take care now. I hope we can be friends. I was broken How could they say you made me come undone Now I know that it's okay Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them Okay, I am just finishing up folding this load of laundry really quick And I'm just draping any of the clothes that get hung up Um on Waverly side of her bed and then I will go ahead and fold those but I kind of like vary how I fold laundry sometimes I will just fold it like right in here but I find that there's just not a ton of room for all of the clothes um and sometimes I just do it in the living room but I find lately Waverly thinks it's funny to take all the clothes I folded and go and hide them so it kind of just depends on if I want to deal with that for the most part I don't mind especially because she's just grabbing like washcloths and stuff but like when it's like a ton of like t-shirts and stuff, I get annoyed, but it's all good. It's just a part of it, but I'm starting that load of laundry of Waverly's now, and then we're going to move on into this kitchen. It really wasn't too messy. I just needed to tidy up the counters really quick, do the dishes, um, and just kind of just do some cleaning up in here. I cleaned the appliances off, like the outside and then i will give the floors a good sweep and mop too because i like to do that every week as well
don't know what my deal was on this particular day. Normally, I'm the type of person where I will, like, tackle all of the counters and then I'll do the, like, unload the dishwasher if I need to or I'll load the dishes, tackle all of that, and then if I need to clean the appliances, I will. But I was just kind of, like, all over just doing things as I was, like, seeing that they needed it done. So, after I got done cleaning off some of the appliances, I went ahead and put away some shoes, took out some garbage that needed it, and then, as you can see, this rug gets so dirty. We... Our snow this year has been very odd. Um, we'll get like a huge snowstorm and then it'll like rain the next day so it'll like all melt and it's just very odd. Normally we get tons and tons of snow. We have like the biggest snow banks but this year we just don't and it's it's really weird. It'll be like winter one day and then like spring the next. So I wanted to shake that off while I just had my slippers on and everything and that way I could vacuum that and then put it away because we do get quite a few little rocks. So I went ahead and did that. Now I'm gonna go ahead and unload this dishwasher really quick and then we will load it up and hand wash a few dishes too. So here I was just cleaning up a ton of pasta that was in the bottom of the sink. Trajan had made like Alfredo and pasta the day before this and apparently when he was like straining it a whole bunch of it fell and we just didn't get it cleaned up that night. So I went ahead and got all that out and put it into the garbage and hand washed. I really didn't have honestly too many dishes that I had to hand wash on this day which always makes it really nice. So I'm going to clean out the sink and then we're going to start tackling the floors. I'm just going to be vacuuming them today. So I went ahead and started out by vacuuming this entryway, entryway rug, moved it, vacuumed all that area, and then I just kind of went around my whole floor area and did the same thing. And then we will get out my mop bucket here soon. Um, and I'm just using some hot water pine salt and I'm just going to use my O-Speeder mop. O -cedar mop and mop up the floors once we get them all vacuumed first and I just really love a day where I can just fully clean my house in a day and just get it all nice and refreshed. It just smells clean, it feels clean and I know since we don't have a very big house like it's manageable for me to be able to clean it in one day but I know for a lot of people that especially as you have more kids and you have like multiple like bedrooms and stuff it gets to be a little bit I totally hit my head right here too when I was trying to see if I'd gotten all of the like uh stuff that was on the floor that really hurt but um I don't know what I was saying but anyways I just really like being able to get it clean one day now there are some days where I'll just tackle like the floors or I'll tackle like my bathroom or I'll tackle the sheets it kind of just depends but for the most part I really like to do this on a weekly basis just resetting my house getting it nice and fresh and clean you'll have to let me know what you do Keep on driving and driving along the road to never end. I 
just finishing up these floors and then that's gonna do it for today's video thank you guys all so much for being here and hanging out with me in today's video i hope you found it motivating and you were able to clean along with me or get the motivation to tackle a space in your home if you enjoyed today's video please give the video a thumbs up and if you want to see more videos like these be sure that you're subscribed so you don't miss any more of them and i will see you guys all in my very next video bye you guys Where I never